Ever wondered how JavaScript allows you to specify default values for function parameters? Well, it's all thanks to default parameters. This feature, introduced in ECMAScript 2015 or ES6 for short, provides a convenient way to handle values that are missing in function calls. To illustrate, consider this JavaScript function. In this example, the greet function has a default parameter, name, which is set to world. When the function is called without providing an argument for name, the default value world is used. So if you call, the output will be hello world. However, if an argument is provided, such as John, the provided value is used instead of the default. So outputs hello John output, but that's not all. Default parameters in JavaScript can also be expressions. Here's an example. In this function, the default value of the height parameter is set to width times two. This allows you to calculate the area of a rectangle with a default aspect ratio of 2 to 1. So if you call, the output will be 16 since height is calculated as 4 times 2, which equals 8. If you call, the output will be 24, as height is explicitly provided as 6. Output. These examples demonstrate how default parameters can significantly enhance the flexibility and usability of functions in JavaScript. They are particularly useful for defining functions with optional arguments or for providing fallback values when certain arguments are not provided. So next time when you're working with JavaScript functions, don't forget to leverage the power of default parameters to make your functions more robust and adaptable. To sum up, default parameters in JavaScript allow you to specify default values for function parameters, handle missing values in function calls, and even use expressions as default values. They were introduced in ECMAScript 2015 and have since become a powerful tool in the JavaScript developer's toolkit.